All right, hey everybody, Evan here from devsun.com, and in this video, we're gonna be covering how to create a welcome message Discord JS bot. So basically what this bot will do is when a user joins your Discord server, it will send a custom welcome message to that user. Now, before we get started, there's gonna be a couple of prerequisites we're gonna to need to cover. If you haven't seen my how to create a Discord bot video, I suggest you go watch that first, just so you have everything set up. But if you already have a Discord JS bot, then just double check that your presence intent and server members intent are both toggled on in your discord developer portal you can see that under the bot section if you just scroll down a little bit make sure both of these are checked just so your bot has the required privileges of receiving that data all right so first we're going to open up vs code or whatever id you're using and we're going to look at our discord js bot project that we just created in the last video if you already have a discord bot that's okay and we're going to go ahead and create a new file and we're going to call this welcome js and right below our config file here we're just going to create a variable called welcome and we're going to set it equal to require dot welcome all right now that we have that let's go ahead and actually utilize that variable so we're going to say welcome and then here we're going to pass in our clients now we're going to pass in our client here because we're going to actually want to use that client inside of this separate js file so we're going to say module dot exports equals clients which is our client that we're passing to this file curly brace now here we're going to add an event listener so we're going to say clients.on and we're going to pass in the event of guild member add then we're going to add a callback function so we're going to say parentheses member curly braces like so and just to test that this event is actually firing let's go ahead and console log this so we're going to say console log and then we're going to log the member that joined our discord server all right so to actually test this i'm going to have to invite a dummy account that i created to the discord server let's go ahead and make sure our bot is actually running so we're going to do node index you can see our discord bot is online and if we head to our discord server we can see that our bot is online currently so let's go ahead and send a invite to our testing account here let's say invite let me go ahead and copy this link here and then i'm just going to join it on our testing account here now we can see that our a testing account got added to the discord server let's go ahead and check our console to see if we have our user and it looks like we do let's look at what we got here we have their id their username whether they're a bot their number id all that good stuff so clearly we can see that this guild member add event is actually firing and has successfully logged our member to the console however let's have a dedicated channel for welcome messages so that way our general channel is not filled up so let's go ahead and create a text channel here we're going to call this welcome and then let's go to our server settings here and let's go ahead and uncheck send a random welcome message when someone joins the server because we don't want both discord's automated message system and our custom one to be sending messages at the same time so let's go ahead and save that and now we're actually going to need to get the id of this channel and the way we can actually get that id is by going to the appearance tab on your discord settings and you're going to want to enable developer mode and this way we can actually right click our channel here here, welcome and we can actually get a copy ID option and with that copy ID option we can actually store that here so let's go ahead and store that in a variable we're gonna say const channel ID and we're gonna set it equal to our ID of our welcome channel like so now that we have our channel ID let's go ahead and create our custom message so we're gonna say const message and we're going to set our const message equal to backticks and then we're going to say welcome and here's where we're going to want to enter their custom username so in order to get their username we're going to have to use some special escape characters here so we're going to do a less than sign an at sign and then we're going to do a dollar sign two curly braces we're going to say member dot id and then we're going to do a greater than sign here to close it off and we're going to say welcome username to our server and now that we have that we're going to need to get our channel so we're going to say const channel and set it equal to member dot guild we're going to get the channels from our guild we're going to get the cache and then here is where we could do dot get and enter our channel id which we created up here which is the id of our welcome channel and then we're going to say channel dot send and our message here so let's go ahead and try this out and see if it works so we're going to say node index to start up our bot i'm going to go ahead and kick that testing account and then we're going to re-invite that testing account and now that i rejoined our testing account we can see in our welcome channel here on our discord server 
welcome DA testing account to our server. And as you can see, our message was sent by the bot that we created here. And real quick, before we end this video, I just want to show you how we can tag another channel. So if we want to direct them to a rules channel, we can. Let's go ahead and create that channel real quick. So we're going to say rules and we're going to need to get this ID of this channel. So again, right click, copy ID, and we're going to say const rules channel, and we're going to set it equal to that ID that we just grabbed. And then at the end of our message here, we're going to say, be sure to check out our, and then we're going to do dollar sign curly braces, member dot guild. Then we're going to get our channels, our cache dot gets, and we're going to get that rules channel variable that we just created. And we're going to say dot to string. So we can convert that to a string. So it looks nice in our message. And now let's go ahead and actually restart our bot here. So we're going to say node index. Once again, going to kick our testing account here and re-invite it. And now when we go back to our welcome channel, we can see welcome DA testing account to our server. Be sure to check out our rules. And if we go to this link here, you can see that it takes us to our rules page. And that is how you create a custom welcome message for your Discord bot. If you found this tutorial helpful, please leave a like and subscribe if you want more content like this. But that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.